Texas Stars are closing in on another playoff appearance. Texas had a convincing 5-1 win over Bakersfield last Tuesday at home, earning a 6-0 record against the boys who used to play in Oklahoma City. Well, I think there's a little bit of a rivalry you know, from the past with them being Oklahoma City. So, and you know, they, we know the way they play a little bit with their past uh, past organization. But we scored some timely goals on the power play and had some timely penalty kills. So, and then at the end of the day, uh, I think Max was outstanding. I think the shots were at 48, 49, 28. So, um, he was the difference in the game tonight. You know, like I said, my D played well. I think uh, they kept they kept it from the outside a little bit. And uh, when I had to make a, a good save, I think uh, I managed to. Uh, move well tonight. I felt really good. So it was a, uh, it's a big two points. Maxime Lagasse turned away 48 shots in that 5-1 win against Bakersfield, while Justin Dowling had four assists against the Condors. The Stars are getting much healthier at the right time of the season, as Travis Morn and Greg Rollo are also back from injury after missing much of the season. The race, uh, the playoffs is getting a little tight, and um, I think that helped uh, for the morale in the dressing room. It's huge getting everyone back, getting closer to the playoffs. Kind of get your line set and kind of get rolling and um, get that chemistry back where everyone's been out and uh, playing with different lineups, different matchups. And so it's nice kind of getting your lines a little more set in stone and rolling into the playoffs here, build that chemistry and, and uh, start playing good and winning hockey games going into the playoffs. Justin's been outstanding in the faceoff circle. You've seen how many times I put him out there in the D zone. You know, if he's not getting points, uh, he's doing a lot more in the D zone and contributing in that aspect. So for us to see him contributing in the faceoff circle and getting some points is just a, a, a bonus for us in, in, in his game. So uh, he's been solid. And then with Travis coming back and Greg coming back, it just kind of gives them all that veteran leadership. And they're still trying to find their game a little bit. And, um, you know, so as we get closer to playoffs, we want to see our team gel, gain that chemistry, and gain that confidence moving forward. It's fun to see. Uh all the boys back, you know, it's a, for sure uh, it helps the power play and everything. Uh, but, uh, you know, we, I think while they were gone, the young guys, we, they did a great job too. And, uh, but uh, like I said, it's really, it's really good to see them back and have them back on the ice. The Stars split a pair of games against the Charlotte Checkers over the weekend. And with 38 wins with only 24 losses, Texas can clinch an AHL playoff spot this weekend when they host San Jose. Julius Honka continued his point streak to five games with a goal. Texas feels good about peaking at the right time of the year. If the name Nicholas Hansen sounds familiar, it should. The Dallas Stars drafted him in the third round back in 2013. Hansen signed a three-year entry-level contract and has also signed an amateur tryout agreement for the remainder of the season with the Texas Stars. It's a dream that you have as a kid to come over and play here in North America. And it's going to be so fun to be here and play games and uh, hopefully help the team. So. The six foot one inch, 180 pound defenseman Hansen hopes to be a spark off the bench for the Texas Stars. Well, the Mafia just got bigger in our dressing room, so obviously he's a, you know, he's a prospect and we want to see what he can do on the ice. Texas is winless in 10 games against the two division leaders in the Western Conference, so they know positioning themselves in the postseason will be key. The Stars are in their seventh season in Cedar Park and know what it takes to get back to playing playoff hockey. In Cedar Park, Jeff Power, Stars Insider.